Hello, welcome to the review with me, John. Today I'm following in the previous uh, footsteps that I've been doing and doing a beer review right after I do a ramen review. And today's beer is from Motor Row Brewery. Motor Row Brewing it is craft beer from the city that works. And this is called the, oops, let me throw it the other way, Reclamation Lager. This is the year, this is the the brewery's number one flagship beer, and it is a Munich style Hell's, and it is made in Chicago. Chicago is where Motor Row Brewery is. Um, it doesn't say anywhere on this can exactly where it is, but uh, it's in the Motor Row area of Chicago. Let's uh, crack it open. Hopefully it's a cold one. It is. It's been the fridge. Don't got any boys with me, though. In the, the socks glass, it will go. This is a pour from a 12-ounce can. And as you can see, it's a four and a half percent alcohol by volume. So on the lower end of ABV, let's give it a sniff. Mm, not too fragrant. Let's give it a taste. Excuse me. This is Motor Road Brewing's Reclamation Lager. Cheers. Very light, very crisp and refreshing. This is what they call lawnmower style beer, where it's not beating you over the head with too much strong flavors, not overly bitter, not overly malty, but it just has that classic flavor of beer and summer. If you're not looking for anything heavy, you want something light, you want refreshing, you want to sit out in the sun, this is a good one to go with. Maybe you're a fan of beer, but you just don't like those uh, dark stouts or those dark lagers, anything that has uh, too strong a flavor to it. This is probably going to be a good beer for you to go to. Um, Motor Road Brewing, I was there and I tasted some other stuff there, and they do have more intense flavors, um, and they do have more... Uh, darks and they have some sours I believe as well but uh, this was the one that uh, on the specific day that I went that I enjoyed the most it was a hot day I've been walking around outside a lot and I didn't want anything too heavy to weigh me down so this is the one I tried at the brewery so it's the one that I bought a pack of to bring home to do a review for you so yes I have tried this one uh, before I crack this one open, but uh, I knew it would be good, and I knew that some people might find this interesting and enjoyable. I know I didn't, I didn't know about Motor Row uh, until uh, my sister actually came to town and went on to Groupon, and we got uh, a good deal for a tasting, and found out that this one was pretty enjoyable. Well, they were all kind of enjoyable, but like I said, this one, on a specific day, was the best one for me. So, out of ten, it's not something that you're going to drool over, say, oh, well, this is the most delicious beer ever, but it's a good, refreshing uh, brew. That being said, this one out of 10, I'm going to give an 8.
8 out of 10. I would definitely have it again. I would definitely recommend it to you guys. If you are in Chicago, going through the Motor Row uh, neighborhood, stop by at Motor Row Brewing and taste something. Bring something home with you. They got a tap room that you can get pints there. And they have cans and growlers and ways to bring it home with you. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm going to start putting my beer and my ramen videos onto playlists. And maybe it'll appear here. The playlist. If I remember to do that. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully you guys enjoy the these beer videos I do. And until next time, guys. Bye.